In today's video, I will be sharing with you how to effectively remove flakes and dandruff from your scalp to ensure your scalp is thoroughly cleansed after your regular wash day routine. So let's get into it. So after experimenting with not washing my hair or oiling my scalp for almost two months, this is the state of my scalp. It became extremely dry and flaky. Now bear in mind that I have been dealing with a problematic scalp for a very long time. So if you are someone who usually experience excessively dry flaky scalp or even dandruff, seborrheic dermatitis or skin conditions such as psoriasis or eczema, then if you didn't maintain your regular wash day routine, you will find yourself in a situation like this. Now, if you don't usually have any scalp conditions, then you probably won't find yourself in this situation. But I was able to fix my scalp issues and I will continue to share how I did that in this video. However, before washing my hair and scalp, I did my best to remove as much flakes from my scalp using my comb to ensure that my scalp would be thoroughly cleansed and feeling refreshed after my wash day routine. Now, usually after washing our hair and scalp, we often assume it was a job well done until we take a look under a microscope. So with that, let's take another close look at my scalp after washing my hair following this method. Now in this footage, I had towel dry my hair and as you can see, my scalp appears to be wet, but it also appears that there is a film on my scalp, right? Well, that film appearance are indeed flakes that wasn't effectively removed from my scalp before washing my hair despite using my comb to remove the flakes. As this is my scalp three days later. And seven days later. Now, if you're dealing with dandruff or an excessively dry, flaky scalp, I recommend effectively exfoliating your scalp before proceeding with your wash day routine. Now, to do that, you would need the following. Shampoo of your choice, a tinting bowl or a bowl of your choice, a tinting brush or applicator brush, edge brush or toothbrush, and water. To ensure you are exfoliating your scalp thoroughly, section your hair into quarters. Working on one section at a time, further divide your first quarter section by parting smaller sections and applying shampoo directly to your scalp using the tinting brush or applicator brush. Do this with each section. After this, fill your tinting bowl with water. Then going back to the first quarter section, once again, you are going to part smaller sections. Dip your edge brush or toothbrush into the water and gently move the brush back and forth on your scalp in a scrubbing motion. Now, you don't want to apply too much pressure to the scalp as the skin is quite soft and it may leave your scalp feeling sensitive. Repeat this step across your entire scalp. 
Now personally, I don't believe what I'm dealing with is dandruff as besides the flakes, I don't experience any other symptoms of dandruff such as having an itchy scalp or dealing with redness or irritation, nor does my scalp has an odor. My scalp only flakes up within two to three days after washing my hair. However, the shampoo I used to help clear my scalp was the Nizoral Anti-Dandruff Shampoo which treats and prevents symptoms of dandruff which includes dry and flaky scalp. Now, if you're a vegan, you may want to stay away from the Nizoro shampoo in the pink bottle as that one contains animal collagen, but the one in the blue bottle doesn't. Or alternatively, you can use the Help Serin shampoo which controls symptoms of psoriasis, seborrheic dermatitis and dandruff and it also prevents flakes and scalp buildup. So if you're dealing with any scalp issues like dry, flaky, itchy scalp or scalp conditions like dandruff, psoriasis, eczema or seborrheic dermatitis, you can use either of these shampoos. Then proceed to wash your hair as normal. Now, if you're like me and you wash your hair twice in one sitting before conditioning your hair, there is no need to exfoliate for the second wash. Now, after following this method, this was my scalp after my wash day. Thoroughly cleansed. Now to maintain and to minimize my scalp from becoming flaky, I follow up with the Hair We Grow Hair Oil which is packed with nourishing oils like castor oil, coconut oil and olive oil which work to moisturize and soothe the scalp and it also contains a blend of essential oils which have antibacterial and antifungal properties that can help to combat dandruff. And this is my scalp seven days after my wash day, which by this point my scalp would be flaky. But as you can see, there are little to no flakes. So even after using a shampoo that helps to get rid of your flakes, you must follow up with an oil that will nourish your scalp and prevent these symptoms from recurring. And honestly, as of today, I am absolutely 100% flake free following this method. Visit the website herewegrow.store to get 15% off when you use the code FLAKEFREE at checkout. And with that, we hope you found today's video very helpful. And until next time, we will be right back here with another one.